for this next step, we're going to be installing the motherboard. Oh. There it is. So, take extreme care when working with the motherboard. You want to make sure that you are not carrying a static charge. So, make sure you're grounded. Make sure your hands are nice and dry. I'm going to go ahead and put this little back plate in place first. So that's going to be easy enough. Let's just take this little plate and set it in the place here. It's a pretty standard sizing piece there, so it'll just kind of pop into place for you. Looks kind of nice on the back plate there, as you see. All right, so once we get that face plate in place there, we are ready to install the motherboard. But uh, the first thing you want to do is take these little golden pieces right there. Those are going to prop up into the uh, location here. You just kind of screw them into place and they're going to give us a little offset so that when you go to screw in your motherboard, they will sit nicely into place. Those four little screws that came with the case are now ready. So you just line those up with the little eyelets. Use that screwdriver. There we go. Now, so those were just finger tight. I'm going to use the screwdriver to crank them on and down. You don't want to damage the motherboard, so you don't have to really apply too much force. There we go. All right. So see, what that does is it just gives it a solid foundation. And now, it sits nicely in the case, as you can see. And also, that back plate now has all of these different connections showing through. Looking good. Looking good.